Hey y'all, today I'm going to show you how to fix that GPU problem we're having on Halo Infinite where it's showing display adapter disabled. Um, so two things, one, you're going to want to have the Steam version of the game, not the one on Game Pass. Um, the issue with the one on Game Pass is getting into the folders and changing what you need to change. You need to enable a bunch of permissions and it just became a hassle. Um, so download the Steam one. And two, this fix is for people that are having issues where your graphics card is being listed, but it's still not working. So if your graphics card isn't listed, this video is not for you. Um, there is other videos out there on how to fix that, but this isn't it. I'm showing you if your graphics card is listed on there, but for some reason it's still showing disabled. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to fix that. Okay, so you're gonna go down here to the search bar, uh, type in DX Diag. Uh, wait a second, it's gonna pop up this little page here. Uh, you can wait for it to finish loading. Um, once it's done, go ahead and click that button that says save all information. You can name it whatever, just save it to your desktop so it's easier to access. Um, okay, now go ahead and open it up. You're gonna scroll down to display devices. Um, right here where it says device key, look for the number right here. It's a four digit number. So that's the number that was giving me problems. So I did have my graphics card listed on there, but those four digits on in my data folder were a little bit, it was off by one, I believe. I think it was like 2205 or something, and that's not what it was supposed to be. Um, all right, so now you're gonna go to where your game is saved. So scroll down, I have mine in my SSD drive. Um, I'm gonna go down there. I have it under Steam Library, so you're gonna, I don't know if it's in the same spot for you. Um, go ahead, open Common and Halo Infinite. Scroll down till you get to Data, Hardware, and then it's for NVIDIA GPUs. I, I don't know about AMD, this is just for the NVIDIA cards. All right, go ahead, and open that. Scroll down, uh, my card is a 3080 Ti, so I'm gonna scroll down until I find that one. Um, now I already went ahead and changed mine before and I already saved it. Um, but the number that was on there previously, I believe was 2205. So go ahead and look at that key that you have there. Mine was 2208. Um, go ahead and change that. Hit file, save. I already saved mine, so I, I didn't need to do it again. Um, go ahead and open up Halo Infinite. Give it a second to load. Okay, go ahead and press enter. Um, now you're gonna go to settings, video, and there you go. My 3080 Ti is showing up now. It was previously disabled. That's it guys. Um, if this video helped you out, don't forget to like and follow. And if I run into any more bugs, I'll go ahead and try to fix those.